Hi, welcome to Chaparral Motorsports. Today we're talking about boots. In front of me I have the Garnet SG10, which was once, at one time, Garnet's flagship boot. This is a great boot. It ha offers all the bells and, bells and whistles of a high-end boot. Uh, definitely a very comfortable boot. If you're looking for a great motocross boot, or you're out there in the desert and you want some be better protection than maybe what you're wearing now, definitely check out the Garnet SJ10. Let me tell you a little bit about this boot. This boot's actually constructed of a full grain Italian leather. Uh, it is produced in Italy, so uh, hand-picked leather. Definitely gives you the quality that you would come to expect from Garnet. Uh, it also has a injected molded plastic on the, both the shin guard, the top of the toe box, the inside of the boot, and you have what's called the floating razor back. What this floating Razorback does, and this is a very vital, vital piece of this boot, and this is what kind of really helped put Garnet out there on the market with these boots, is it has a pivoting ankle system, which really allows this boot to pivot very easily right out of the box. So you're going to get a lot of movement out of the boot. It's not going to be a very rigid boot. But what this floating Razor does is in the event of a hard impact, you come up short, you go long, it actually helps transfer the energy that's created at the base of the boot Rather than damaging your ankle, it helps divert that energy up the back of the boot. So now what you're going to have is a very good structure for moving that energy all the way up and into your legs versus boots that don't have this type of a system. That energy now is focused right here at your ankles, and that's where you can have problems is at your ankles. So this boot is a great boot, especially for motocross. Like I said, it definitely is uh, definitely one of the best boots out there. When you're talking about the interior of the boot, they're using a shock absorbing footbed. So definitely, again, in the event of a hard impact, you're gonna have that cushion between the outside of the boot and, and then your foot itself. They're using a steel shank down through the boot with a steel toe. Uh, also, you'll have four buckle systems here. These are aluminum buckles. So they click in, they stay in. Once they're in, no problem there. It allows for a custom fit with these buckles because you can actually adjust the length of the strap as well. Uh, for some of you riders out there that have bigger calves or you're running knee braces, these actually have a very big mouth at the top of them. So they're going to accept a lot of leg, knee brace, all that. If you need more room, you can actually purchase separately a longer top strap, which will really allow this boot to open up. When this boot is opened up, let me just show you real quick here. It's got a Velcro closure. This boot really opens up, so it's very easy on, very easy off. Uh, you've got this floating system on the shin guard, which is allowed. This is adjustable as well off of those straps, so it's really going to set up your placement of where your shin guard is uh, in, re in relation to where your boot is. Um, buckle this thing down real quick here. And you'll notice with these buckles, once they're clicked into place, they're not going anywhere. So once you've got your straps adjusted, you shouldn't have to mess with these anymore. You get to the track, you get your gear on, you click these guys closed and you're good to go. On the inside of the boot, to help really help keep you hanging on, um, you know with motocross obviously and a lot of desert, you're really biting down with the insides of your boot. So Garnet has actually put rubber pads on the inside of the ankle and on the inside of the top upper part of the leg. This really helps you to grip a hold of the bike and hang on to the bike with your legs and helps with rider fatigue at your upper body. So you really can bite down. This rubber really gets a hold of the bike itself and doesn't want to move around a lot. Plus, if you get up against the pipe or something hot like that, that will definitely help keep you from melting into the boot or damaging the boot. They're using a dual, compo dual composite sole in this boot, which is replaceable. So if you do wear the sole out of this boot, you can send it to Garnet and they can resole the boot for you, keeping your boots uh, for the life that uh, you know they, 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 they deserve to live. Uh, you wear out the sole, boot's still good, you don't want to throw that thing away. Obviously they're a high-end boot, so you want to keep that thing, you want to go ahead and get it resold and keep it out there on the track. This boot is available in a couple of different colorways, all adult sizes. Check out our website at chaparral-racing for details. And as always at Chaparral Motorsports, we have our low price guarantee. If you find a lower advertised price from any authorized U.S. dealer on an in-stock product, call or email us and we'll match any verifiable price. For more information on Garnet or our low price guarantee, check out our website at chaparral-racing.com, your destination for anything motorsports. Thanks for watching and enjoy your ride.